A multi-county high-speed chase ended in a crash this afternoon in Wayne County. Four people are now in custody as troopers investigate possible ties to crimes in New York. Here's WREL's Eric Miller. This chase came to a screeching halt right here, the shoulder of US 70 just west of Goldsboro. The suspect's car leaving tracks in the mud and questions for the troopers now investigating. It started as a speeding call around 2 p.m. State Highway Patrol saying a car blew past a trooper in Sampson County, then refused to stop. The chase then winding into nearby Wayne County, where the suspect sideswiped one car before being hit by another at the intersection of US 70 and Miller's Chapel Road. The suspect's car then coming to a stop right in front of this Clayton Homes dealership. Jump and run and currently think they're inside of a house. Employees at two nearby businesses confirm the four suspects ran inside this Clayton Homes office. An employee there saying the suspects hid in the back of the building before troopers arrived and arrested them. These eyewitness photos snapped outside show multiple people in handcuffs. I believe they said they got four of them. SHP says they're trying to confirm the names and ages of the four arrested, though several are likely under 18. Investigators also working to determine if the car they were in was stolen and if there's a tie to crimes out of state, including in New York. State Highway Patrol confirms these four will be facing at a minimum felony eluding, among other charges. We'll continue following this case and bring you updates as soon as we get them. In Wayne County, Eric Miller, WRAL News.